Right, well the work on Milo 2 proceeds. Um, very, very slowly, this is becoming the number one touring vehicle in Australia, off-road. As far as I'm concerned anyway, you know, but I like them in green. And talking about green, years ago, and I'm talking maybe 15 years ago, uh, one of the first things we did to the original Milo was to fit one of these. This is an RV tank, RV accessories, uh, it's a poly tank. The one in Milo is 40 litre. John from MMAC Industries put me onto them and he said, look, you know, it's the duck's nuts. Well, guess what? It is the duck's nuts. I've had water in Milo for the last 15, 16 years. Never had a problem with the tank. Um, had stuff knocked around all over the place because it's in the back of the truck, just like this one will be. And nothing's ever gone wrong. These tanks are just fantastic. The water tastes great, even when I leave it for ages. Don't know why that is. Maybe it's just this great Brisbane water we put in today. Um, this one's got a filler on top. It's going to fit between the wheel wells right at the back, which means that we've got 80 kilos, um, probably 81 kilos, I guess, of weight right up there, right near the rest of the weight, which is perfect. And it comes with a pump. It's got a pressure pump. So we're just going to put a tap and a switch on one side, be able to have a shower. It's going to be awesome. Well, uh, there you go. All finished. The tank's in. And um, just like John said, that John from NMAC, it is a perfect fit. It's also a beautiful addition to, a, to an off-road vehicle. 80 litres of water. And because this one, you know, Aussie made really good. It's never going to go anywhere. It's just beautiful. Um, comes with a pump. I've got the tap mounted up here, I've got a little switch here, and look at that. I've just got to point out that's, that's not me, that's the tap. Now, there's enough pressure there if I pull that hose out, you know, if you see me having a bit of a tub on the side of the road, you'll know what's going on. Uh, I promise you I won't do it on the side of the road, alright? But, um, yeah, beautiful, beautiful fitting, beautiful piece of gear, and... You know, for someone who's done as much severely outback stuff as I have, um, water is everything. I'm still going to be carrying spare water around the place. I never trust all my water to one thing ever. But if I had to, this would be it. And now I'm going to be clean too. Thanks, John. Milo 2, brought to you by the best names in the business and a whole bunch of my mates helping out.